It's that time of the year again. Time to wash the car. Time of the week. <laughs> time to wash the old Camry. I've got one of these things. Uh, you can plug in the hose directly into this, but I've never done that. Yep. And I just wash my car with good old Dawn. Dabble do ya. Now you may be saying to yourself, okay, Prepper Princess, it looks really nice on the outside, but what about the inside? Aren't you gonna vacuum it? No, I don't vacuum the inside of my car. I leaf blow it. I will demonstrate. Take a look. I had to go and put the phone in the fridge. It overheated and wouldn't let me record. So here is what it looks like after. Boom, boom, boom. So now all that is left is taking my armor all, giving it a quick polish. Then I'm gonna go over to Baskin Robbins and treat myself to an ice cream cone. I personally prefer the air freshening protectant that smells like a new car because it really does smell like a new car and I like my car to smell like new so I can pretend it's new. 
It is a 98 Toyota Camry with only about 85,000 miles on it. Today was definitely a car day. I've filmed a little bit of my stupidity, but today I did my own oil change. I switched out some fuses. My blinker, my right turn signal, like every time I went to turn the car, the left one was fine, clink, 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 clink. The one to the right, clink, 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 clink. It was called crazy. The dome light didn't work, it works now. And uh, the cigarette lighter, which you will see pretty soon. And in about a week or two, I'm not gonna start a diet. I'm just gonna start changing my eating habits because I have, I have gained a lot of weight, a lot of weight. I am at the second highest I've ever been in my adult life. And I don't worry about it too much. I mean, I'm still within healthy limits, but um, because I'm moving, I've been eating up my stockpiles so I don't have to move it. And I've been in kind of a hurry to eat it. So, you know, don't, don't let it go to waste. And I gained a lot of weight doing that over the last few months. And it's just time to get all that extra weight off. And no, I'm not gonna turn this into like a diet vlog or anything like that, because it's not a big deal. For, for me to lose 20 pounds, it's not really that big of a deal. I just eat less and exercise more. You know, kind of what the doctor tells you to do. All right, let me go in the back seat. So since living in the desert, I got sweat in my eye because it's 100 degrees. And it, sweat is salty and it's like having salt in your eyes and my eyes really hurt right now. Oh my gosh. And this is a dog car, so it's got doggy drool everywhere. Dog hair everywhere, even though I, that's why I have to wash it once a week. I don't like, I don't like having a dirty car. Oh. Whoa, where are you going? Okay. So I'm almost to the last of my stockpile. And that's a good thing. When I move, I'm gonna go ahead and redo the stockpile because I like to have six months to a year's worth of food on it. Look how dirty I am, oh my God. Let's clean ourselves with some armor all. <laughs> uh, dirty and sweaty and gross. All right, it is looking pretty good. Washed inside and out, switched out the fuses, did an oil change, I got a full tank of gas, and something else that I can't remember. <laughs> but my car is now in perfect working order, and except for the cigarette lighter, but you'll see after this what I did about that. It's gonna be a beautiful day. So washing your own car saves money, um, I always use my, oh, and I always recommend microfiber cloths. They pick up everything. They clean everything. You can wash your windows with water if you use microfiber cloths. I got mine in a package of like 5,000, not really, but like a huge package of microfiber cloths at like Lowe's for like $9. And you can wash them and reuse them. I've only used like three and I just keep washing and reusing them. So that is your tip for the day. Whatever you can do, do it yourself. And when it comes to repairing things, don't be afraid to do it wrong because even if you do it wrong, it was already broken in the first place. Do what you can with what you've got. Prepper Princess What's out. up, YouTube? Do you all want to know how dumb I am? Wow, I am dumb. <laughs> I'm in my 98 Toyota Camry and I the cigarette lighter does not work. And I'm sitting here and I'm like, okay, maybe the fuse needs to be replaced, uh, whatever. So I go out, I buy my giant fuse set and I'm in here and I've got, I've got this little thing like taken apart, putting in the fuse. I've got, I'm in the trunk putting, going together with the fuses. And I'm like, man, this cigarette lighter is just not going to work. Like I cannot find which fuse is the cigarette lighter. And then there's this, I was watching this video. <laughs> 
of this guy, he's like, <laughs> he goes, he goes, so I'm going to show you where the fuse for your cigarette lighter. Hold on. Let me turn this so around. I'm going to show you where the fuse for the cigarette lighter and power supply is. And I'm like, wait, what? So here's the cigarette lighter. And then he flips this thing open and it's got a power supply. And I have been using this to just fill up my tires and it would not work in the lighter. I have never seen that. I've never noticed it. And now I can fill up my tires. I have had a 98 Toyota Camry for about 13 years. Never knew that. That is how dumb I am. What? You watching me, puppy? Which, you want to come help? You going to come help, mommy? Yeah, I see your tail wagging. Oh, yeah, your mommy's dumb. We, we all know that. We all know how dumb she is. Yes. I spent $24 on those fuses. But, hey, I needed to replace some of the fuses anyway. So, yeah. Good morning. Just taking our, what is it, dawn sunrise walk. Come on, Nola. Come on. Come on. Get your butts moving. Come on. Come on. Let's go. Rocky, I don't want to have to switch your leash again. These two are happy as clams. I'm thinking of getting a leash so that Rocky walks Nala. The ones where the dogs attach to each other. Because uh, that might be easier for me.